Yeah, it feels wonderful. Yeah. All right, this is a stunning uh, uh, reference 54 tenor from Selmer. Uh, uh, definitely top of the line. It's interesting, I think they are not making these anymore. I've heard from multiple people that Selmer is not going to make these anymore. They're doing the Supreme now. Uh, which is a fantastic instrument, of course. I mean, I've tried the alto. I can't wait to try a tenor someday. But um, uh, I like a lot of the instruments Selmer's made, so I think this one uh, uh, is definitely piquing my curiosity today. I thought I'd give it a try and let folks hear it. So man, feels great. Uh, uh, feels it's got more of a kind of a classic keyboard feel to me. I feel like my modern one has deeper uh, cups in the pearls, but there's a little sensation of a little edge right on the outside of the pearls here. Uh, that's interesting. So it's like it's a little line. Feels very clean, very tight, very crisp, very easy to play. All of Selmer's horns are so well built, and and uh, they're just very easy to play. So this is a very easy to play horn. Uh, wonderful, uh, rich, big sound. It's definitely got more of like a classic jazz sound. <laughs> My conclusions on this thing, it is a super awesome horn. Um, it would take a minute that, you know, it's interesting. The most different thing for me than my main horn, which is also pretty modern summer, it's like seven years old or something, it's a, a um, or six, five, how? Oh, it's Jubilee Edition uh, uh, Super Action 80 uh, uh, Series 2. Whatever year that's from, I gotta type in the thing. But that's my every day. And uh, that one, the key work feels just a little different. I feel like I can slide between a little easier. But that, to me, that's just a matter of, you know, I've played it for years. I play it all the time, every day. So it's a uh, very use of my fingers. I'm sure this one would be right there soon. It's felt a little different. I love uh, metal hook. Everything's just really top of the line on this. Um, like I said, they're not making these anymore. This one, this one that exists in real life is at Beacock Music in Vancouver, Washington. If you have, uh, you know, uh, a saxophone dream and some cash, uh, uh, get in touch with them. Buy this thing. They're not making them anymore. These aren't going to be here. And this is a really, really neat, neat, neat model um, with a really beautiful sound and just everything about it is super solid. This thing is like a tank and uh, it just feels great. So, hope you're having a good one. Check it out, you know. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 